Tilo, what's poppin'? We are on Twitch. We are not live, but you can leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notification bell. Let's continue to grow the family from Chicago to the UK. Uh, right above me, if we do go live and you happen to miss it, this is where things will be highlights and things of that nature. Don't forget, we do got the Patreon. This is a list of everything that's currently on there, man. Appreciate all my Patreon family, man. Salute. Let's grow it. Don't forget, we do got the merch. Appreciate everybody who cops something, man. Uh, that's that's this is if you cop merch, you're really above and beyond. <laughs> you doing a lot. I appreciate it. Uh, the link to all that's down in the description. But this this I feel like this funny. I'm gonna put it on mute because I don't want them to read for me. I want to read them myself. But British memes must do's for foreigners when visiting England. Okay. I feel like I'm a nationalist at this point though. When I was visiting, a homeless man saw me looking at a big bin and said, Oi, they don't have clocks in America? <laughs> hey. It's so funny how Americans don't have proper cheese. Like, what is this? God, y'all going fast. Are you Okay. It's not until I started frying food on TikTok that I didn't know that we didn't have proper cheese, chocolate, dairy, eggs. There's a litany of things that are are not right here. Even chicken, like, it's bogus. I was today years old when I found out these bad boys go this deep into the ground. What is that? Oh, that's a mailbox. That's the same thing she said. <laughs> My bad. Brits encouraged to get rats as pets as they are sociable, intelligent, and friendly. Hopefully the rats can pass these traits on <laughs> to the British people. I like the British people's personalities, man. I found my favorite Tumblr post again. British people be like, wakes up during a heart transplant. Right? What's all this? <laughs> hey, hey, when I read that, all I could think about is Carl Pilkington. Do British people still do the accent when nobody's around? This is a good question. No, because really, like, think about it. Like, you know how you be... I can't be the only one. Like, I got you, When you got a voice in your head and you're trying to think... You're thinking about stuff in your head, there's a voice. And it's normally your voice. Is that voice for y'all in y'all accent? I don't know why I have these on. Every British politician sounds like a dark soul boss. Wait, now nah, you're going too fast. The Lord Adonis, the Lord Falconer of Thornton, the Lord Archer of Weston Supermar, Rio, the Baroness Backwell of Hardington Mandeville. Dark souls. I never played the game. The father protecting his daughter's ears during the the blitz. <laughs> 1941. I don't know what the blitz is. Is British fruit really that bad? No, it's not. Honestly, it's not. Some of it, but not all of it. I had um, a crab paste today. Terrible. If made correctly, yes. <laughs> Praying for the people in England. Don't ever talk to me about airplane. What happened there? They live that way. What? Some of these I gotta unmute. Let's just unmute because this could take forever. That's a fiesta or a focus. I can't actually tell. Focus mate. I'm trying, but I have ADHD. It's <laughs> no, it's a focus, not focus. Like. Stranger Things was British. Bit odd in it. There are 300. Crying, but I have ADHD. If Stranger Things was British, bit odd. Bit odd, isn't it? Bit odd, isn't it? Stranger Things, bit odd, isn't it? That's fine. Odd, isn't it? There are 319 beans and 8 sausages in a can. But who took the beans out the can and counted each individually like this? Like, you are no life in a Heinz can of beans? 
That's a, you don't have a life. And of Heinz Beans pork sausage. British people be like, I'm British. <laughs> I'm British. It's because it's because they drank the tea. <laughs> yes. They drank the tea. You can't park there, mate. Friday. His hands are boxing glove level. Oh, whoa. It's because they drank the tea. You can't park there, mate. Friday. His hands are boxing glove. Why is his hands so big? Who is this? Is this our president? Who is this? Who is this? Is this Joe Biden? He drinks some more water. Yeah, his hands are boxing glove level. Whoever told Whoever told me to come to London <laughs> Me to come to London. It was me an apology. Scrap out Scrap Scrap outside Parton School on grass if anyone wants it. Outside Parton School on grass if anyone wants it. You're a fully grown man offering to fight people outside of school. Get a fuck grip, mate, and keep off the drink. What the fuck are you on about, you fucking muppet? Scrap metal. Keyboard war. Now nah, this is like, honestly in my comments, this is what y'all this is how y'all be sounding to me. I'll be looking like what they talking about. <laughs> Keyboard warrior. A very British looking street in America. Sign at work today. This it did look British. That was probably like Phil Pennsylvania or something. Spider's infestation problem is mostly resolved. Or oh, the That's that's they moving different with a whole commercial? This is sixteen minutes of memes. Unskippable? You get in that bag, ain't you? Oh, the skippable. The spiders have learned to use the printer. Message from the dog groomers. Hi, Dexter is dead. Hi, Dexter is ready now. Sorry, stupid autocorrect. He had a great time. Thought I found <laughs> 20 pounds on the bus. Was in a great mood until I unfolded it. And it was some sort of religious pamphlet. Geezer in front of me on the train is using a Twix as a pillow. It's a waste of a Twix. Now it's crooked. Who eats crooked Twixes? This guy is a menace. Decent three out of four star burger and chips. But the cashier was fit, so it bumps it up to five. Hi Tesco's, I've got a serious problem with one of your products. Hi Adam, could you please elaborate? Yes, why on earth has your shampoo turned my dog pink? Anyone know this man? He entered my garden and helped himself to my fungi. He was unrepentant when I spoke to him. Bored, so does anyone want to fight? I will give you 50 quid if you win, but you probably won't. Cheers, Tony. <coughs> Woman eats pasta with gravy. Now people want her banned from it. <laughs> Italy. Yeah, can't blame. Uh, yeah, you pushing it. I know y'all put I put y'all put gravy on a lot of stuff, and it gotta be onion gravy. But on pasta is crazy. Mm, to be fair, ordered a 250 milliliter portion of garlic sauce with our takeaway, and I don't know what I was expecting. But it wasn't this. How does it even stay structurally sound to hold this? Don't it got like... Don't it got like holes in the bottom? I can't work out whether this lad is still in school or has worked in insurance for the last 20... Five years. The fact that Newcastle briefly had an upmarket sit down version of Greg's called Greg's Moment truly was peaked in 2010. This sword was found during the search of a vehicle earlier today. Thankfully, it's been taken off the streets. You're doing God's work, mate. Lost an ancestor to a sword like that <laughs> in the 13th. <laughs> You're doing God's work. Lost, a san a, a lost an ancestor to a sword like that in the 13th century. I'm not gonna lie, man. The weaponry y'all carry around never ceases to amaze me, man. This is the same sword they pulled out that stone and he became king or whatever. It's century. Crazy. British cuisine. Why is it that color green? What, what, is, what is this on top? What is that fried article right there? Best in the world. Them peas look like the soldiers from the... Toy Story have been molted. Did you know the only reason there are pyramids in Egypt is because they are too heavy to carry to the British Museum? My postman has left his sack on my doorstop. What does this mean? Am I the postman now? It was just banter. The British Museum will take anything but jokes. Extra second added to green man so fatties can cross the road. Accountant, 38, bullied at work, wanted to go out with a bang, so stole 170k from his bosses and spent it all in one weekend on drugs and women. I can't even be mad at bro. The probability of you being born was around 1 in 400 trillion. 
That's why we gotta cherish life. In fuck's sake, can't win a tenner on scratch card, but can win this shape. <laughs> Existence. Nice one. School bullies in America wouldn't last five minutes in the UK. No, they would. They would bring an M4 though. Why would they bring a motorway to school? Oh my god. Well, new record. Fastest time to drink a Capri Sun. Confident I could smash this record. Married man drives 400 miles to meet Facebook woman, only to discover it's a hoax set up by rival football. That's, now, this is real hooliganism right here. Fans. Man proposes to girlfriend using the side of a cow. Man who stole 200,000 Cadbury's cream eggs, jailed the getaway <laughs> car. Man who ate 124 kebabs in a month, says it left him physically and psychologically damaged. Man who ate 124 kebabs in a month, says it left him physically and psychologically Obviously, it will leave you physically damaged. That's what, in one month? That's like four a day. Of course, you're gonna gain an incredible amount of weight. You're gonna have probably some artery problems, and then you're gonna be sad that you got that you can't move properly, and you sweat when you use the bathroom or take a shower. So of course. Damaged. What's worse, German humor or French hygiene? British food. Morning of my dad's. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. British food is not that bad, but like if you scroll through my TikTok and look at some of the stuff I made, just off sight looking at it, you might question it like, yo, what is this? Wedding. I was 14. Why do I look like a disgraced UKIP candidate? Never not laughed at this. What's missing from this Christmas dinner and oven? This is a real movie coming next year. I can't wait. This movie was ass. ASS. Wait, fucking hell. Paddington took a dark turn since the queen died. Bark, Barksy, a short story. How do you delete someone off Facebook from school that you do not like? This is insane to think about. Mental man, always thought Tokyo was in Japan. What are you doing in this situation? Hiding in WH Smith because that shop refuses to die. <laughs> Be aware, these kids are smashing windows in Roseworth. When asked what they were doing, they said, smashing windows. That's the British for you, know? They don't really lie. They don't really lie. They tell you exactly what's going on. What you look? What does it look like? Very rude message mowed into a field near the Gloucestershire border. What would you say to Princess Diane if she was your mother? What's for dinner, mum? I made a device that checks the council website and lights up to show you what color bin to put out. I call it the Bindicator. Woodland beauty spot haunted by ghosts that tells people to fuck off. Can you lot fuck off with the British thing already? I wish British people took jokes as well as they took other people's cultural artifacts. Gary Lineker <laughs> went through his entire career without receiving a booking. So did my father, lovely fella, but a shit DJ. I accidentally wore a green t-shirt in Asda. Long story short, I'm now covering Sandra's shift. <laughs> On a Sunday, rescuers learn that the exotic bird they found was actually a seagull covered in curry. Can't beat a full English. Did Bacon's not cooked long enough. Mushrooms don't look like they- Nothing's cooked here long enough. It's all raw. Do you cook this with sunlight? <laughs> uh, there's not much sunlight in the UK, so, like... He looks like a microwaved Gordon Ramsay. Don't go out tomorrow. Why? It windy. To the barber in Moldy who did this to my- I for me. It windy. Wait, I'm present stuff that I shouldn't be. Right. Unaccompanied 13 year old, may I suggest you do not give stupid haircuts to minors without an adult present? This is ridiculous. Ariana Grande is now dating Wildstone Raider. What's that rat looking thing? That singer, Ariana Grande. Yeah. Who is this other guy? Wildstone Raider? Awful. What? Oh, is that the dude from, um, from the clips or the football clips? Chip shop paid seven pounds sixty for a kebab. Hardly any meat. Nan was burnt. Rubbish. Never going there again. Sorry to hear about you, Nan. I hope she gets well soon. <laughs> Bear Grylls renames his alarm clock to Opportunity Clock because alarm has negative connotations. What are you doing today? I'm in hospital. Oh no. Why? Having my baby. Yeah. Gutted. I am not out tonight, man. Poor kid. Brits be like Peter Parker. A man pours beer. <laughs> Brits be like Peter Parker. P Peter Parker. Go back. Let me try. Gutted. I am not out tonight, man. Poor kid. Brits. 
Peter Parker. Peter Parker. Be like Peter Parker. A man pours beers into an ashtray for his dog at a pub in Manchester. We used to be a proper country. Yeah, man. It, yeah, yeah. Why do you have a portrait of Hacker of CBBC? It's my dog that passed. R.I.P. I think we should change every public bin to a frog bin. I'm bringing Sexy back. Get it, because he's doing a double chin and cross-eyed face. You, you, sir, have won the internet. I'm bringing Sexy back. Get it, because he's doing a double chin, cross-eyed face. You, sir, have won the internet. As this, okay. No, for today. UK hit by Cadbury's 99. You can hit by Cadbury's 99 flakes. And flake shortage. Just wanted to send my best wishes to everyone sitting their GCSEs today. How do you physically get a one in English? Scouse not English. One sip of a pint and he's up on the table dancing. Can't take this dog anywhere. What is the most successful lie in history? That these are temporary. If you drink cold water. That's in America too. I've seen those and they've uh, been and there for years. It's warm. Technically you're a teapot. This is why. <laughs> I love British. Dad spends £34 on curry only to find out takeaway had been shut down when he went to get it. British people on the website after they accidentally press English US instead of English UK. Can I switch my closed caption to that? What if I want English closed? Okay. British people be like micro crisp. My log cabin is starting to take shape. Michael Chris instead of microchip. <laughs> I urge every youngster to go out and watch. Look at how many sausages the lady and Greg's gave me. Thinking of I urge every youngster to go out and watch. Look at how First of all, those sausages are cooked to perfection. I can see the bread gliss I can see the, the butter glistening off this bun. It looks good, but that's just too many sausages for me. I can't put that much meat in my mouth. How many <sighs> Pause. God damn it. Sausages, the lady in gray. Should end the video with that. Excuse me. Thinking about the mad clutch control Peppa Pig's dad has. You know, always driving up. <laughs> it's an automatic. No, it's not. That's a UK TV show, ain't it? So it gotta have a clutch, cause all y'all cars is clutch. What is that, a Volkswagen Beetle too? Drop top? The month. Clean, ain't it? That's steep hill. Someone hacked into my Netflix account last month and watched every episode of Coco Melon and then left me a note. Thanks for everything, you legend. Told my mum I fancied trainers for Christmas and she got me slazengers. The men who flooded Devon with drugs. Matey in the middle just tucked into these. My dad was like, I met a guy today. Apparently he's pretty famous. I'm like, cool, who? He like, I don't know his name. Then sends a picture. Tell me why it's Harry Styles. The North-South Divide, illustrated by Waitrose. Lol, what the hell? Hello, I am the UK government. You need to pay £1,500 iTunes gift card. Or you un- This is the worst scam I've ever seen. And if anybody has failed for that, like, ew. Under the rest, one of the biggest tragedies in British history. This is not the same person. This is the same person in all of these? Bro went from an Abercrombie and Finch model to this? To a parole board worker? Like, what is going on? Does anyone remember when the whole of UK went yellow back in 2017? The best Snapchat story I've ever seen. Taking Big Man to Southport for ice cream. Only do what your heart told you. Go to the pub. Okay, mate. Hello, mate. I bought a lamp off you, but it didn't turn up. Can you send me proof it didn't arrive? Sure. Things I do when I'm drunk, man. Today only, due to a shortage of Tyrell's crisps, walkers will be included in the meal deal. This would instantly vape- Is Tyrell's the knockoff version? This would instantly vaporize a British person. This looks amazing. This, what is this? Alpa store, cilantro, onion, lime, good sauces. Yeah, that looks good. 
I don't know if y'all flavor palettes is ready for that. That's what they mean by vaporize a British person. Yeah, I don't. I've never seen a taco in 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 in, the, in London. In any video I've ever done, I've never seen y'all eating a taco. And I'm not talking Taco Bell. I'm talking this. Vaporize a British person. Bought these Pandora charms off some bloke in the pub. Monopoly pieces. No, I've got home. I'm thinking they might not be legit. People I call boss. Kebab shop workers. My actual boss. Dad livid after Asda staff allows his seven-year-old son to buy a two-pound scratch card. Doug walks into pub, drinks pint, fights dog, loses, maintains a bow tie. Pig escapes its pen and wanders streets. Teen ends up in Paris after a drunken night out in Manchester. That's not far fetched because it's just a train right away, ain't it? So, at funeral today, the speaker mentioned what football team the deceased supported and someone booed. <laughs> Nobody cares at all. British people could watch their family be murdered and be like, hmm, I don't quite fancy that. Do British websites use biscuits? My brain has actually gone to mush just after serving a customer and her total came to £17.50. And I go to her, that's 10 to 6. US children speaking in British accents because of Peppa Pig, Theresa May, Theresa June. This is the greatest <laughs> she was out of here quick. thing I've seen in a long that's time. Funny. Great Britain and his politics never failed to amuse me. Sometimes I get sad, then this comes across again. Got a rash, use some suit. Pseudochrome. Cut. Pseudochrome. Legs fallen off. Pseudochrome. Wanted by the police for tax fraud. Pseudochrome. Genuinely sold. We got something like that in America too where we use it for everything. Like Vicks Vapor Rub type situation. Yeah, use some Vicks Vapor Rub. You got a cold in your chest. Use some Vicks Vapor Rub. Your baby got a high fever. Use some Vicks Vapor Rub. You got a it's Vicks Vapor Rub. Yeah, that's what we use. Everything. What do they call carrots <coughs> in Europe? <coughs> Americans. Rat, my name is Roy, and I cannot change it. Mom replied, that's heavy that, after being arrested for attempted murder. Police force is running out of vegan meals because they arrested so many. Well, we can skip this one, yes sir. Stop oil protesters. I've just taken my grandson to the park and some idiot has covered the playground in beans. I have cleared as much as I can, but I only had one sheet. This the type stuff going on in the UK? Of kitchen roll. Please be careful. Holiday to Spain. Ruined by too many Spaniards. In Spain. Spanish Hotel. Man dies in Lake District while walking out with his friends. Love the Lake District. Been there many times. Entire pavement stolen overnight from village. Romanian arrived in UK on Friday. Stole on Saturday. Jailed on Monday. What a life. Just cost me one pound to put air in my tires. Used to be 20p. Suppose that's inflation. <laughs> That's a great- Oh, it's dad! Love you dad joke! For you. Rooftop drama as teens filmed throwing custard creams at helpless bystanders. It's just a big clock. One rating. I don't understand all the hype with this clock. It is literally just a big clock. It's going to be a digital one in 30 years. The, the big thing with this clock is, you know what I'm saying? It's never wrong. It's very, very accurate. Like, to the teenth second, to the millisecond, whatever second. Years anyway. Ten best restaurants in Birmingham. Shell Garage. Seagulls are getting drunk on leftover booze. Florida, there's a lot of garages too that, I mean, garages. Um, gas stations, petrol stations that are, that serve elite food as well. But that says a lot about British food and what people think of it. That is, gas station is top 10. And throwing up on firefighters. One was so drunk, it fell off a roof. Dad, who hasn't stopped farting since he ate a ham roll in 2017, sues for 200k. <laughs> Man climbs into speed camera and flashes cars with his phone. Half of Britons would refuse free trip to the moon, fearing there's not enough to see, or that it would take too long. Come get your grub, you fat bitch. Dinner's ready in five. I can bring it up to you if you're in the middle of something. Our dad did not share Euro Millions jackpot, so we smashed his car up with a hammer sorry mom phoned you on accident no worries had you by accident step Dang. one drop tea bag step i i drop one tea bag two pour pour water three let cool down five minutes forget me 80 i'm not reading this car crashes into opticians in kent does anyone own this cat just seen it knock this fence over favorite go-to breakfast i'm not telling you you will get it banned can you turn it down a little please stop screaming like a twat or i will volley that playstation out the fucking window this henry hoover nativity scene is very rent free <laughs> in my head fuming go to wrap my presents thinking i've brought silver wrapping paper clear and i've brought fucking cellophane england versus 
Honestly, this might not be bad if it's spread out around the whole pizza. It's Italy. Just seen this old man struggling to walk down the street after nipping to the shops, saw the young lad stop and asked if he was okay. He carried his stuff and held the man's arm as he got home. This is questionable. This reminds me of the old guy and Stewie or Chris on Family Guy. It's questionable. Well done that lad, credit to his parents. I love online dating, such fun and exciting conversations with new people. Hey Stacy, looks like you're killing it in the gym. How long has it been something you're passionate about? Are you recruiting them on LinkedIn? Not what I was expecting to hear of the bride today, considering it was such a peaceful, laid back wedding. That's lovely, thank you. Just a quick FYI, Alex, my best man, stabbed my brother last night, so we need him in as little footage as possible. Thank you so much for yesterday. What is a person from London called? My neighbor is from London. He is called Rob. Medieval peasants only worked around 150 days in a year. The church believed it was important for them to keep happy with frequent, mandatory holidays. You have less holidays than a medieval peasant. What I think cars looked like 20 years ago. What they really looked like. British Grand Prix today. What I think cars looked like 20 years ago. What they really looked This is a testament to how old we are at this point in time. 20 years ago, that's tough. Like, I'd still ride one of these down here, that Audi. Looked like British Grand Prix today. Is this bloke's stag and his mates have made him wear it. Keeps getting stopped by the police. Four years ago, I was doing trolleys at Sainsbury's on a Monday night. I left, worked hard, and got a degree from the University of Sheffield. Now I'm doing trolleys at Waitrose on a Friday night. Never give up. That degree, man. All a degree proves is that you can stick to something for two or four years. Reasons I'm miserable. I'm British. If it weren't for America, you would be speaking German right now. If it weren't for Britain, America wouldn't even exist. Hmm. Mm. What's the best nickname you've ever heard? A sparky I knew looked like Elton John and got called Socket Man. Cows are friends, not food. Name one cow you're friends with. Your mom. The lowest hey. I'll go is 500. Will you take 100 if I collect now? Sure, my address is. Sounds good. Here now. Go inside. It's a comedy club. Yeah, head to the stage and tell your jokes to somebody. <laughs> This is petty. The else. Hello, this is the police. Sorry to inform you, your rider will probably be arrested. I will try to cancel the order for you. Cut my nephew's hair, and he told me he wanted it like my next door neighbors, who's bald on the top and got a little bit of hair on the side. So, being the great uncle I am, I give the kid. It's neither here nor there, little man. You rocking that. You feel me? Do your thing. Kid, what he wanted. Hold it looking down. for his keys. Did I solve your question? No. Glad to hear that. Couldn't get a taxi home last night, so I went to a takeaway and ordered a pizza to my address and got him with the delivery driver. <laughs> yeah. right now. The mafia will send I've seen that before. Some, I've seen somebody do that before. And it actually worked. Just give a nice little tip and you in there. £13.50 for Scran and a taxi home. I'm a genius. David Tennant faked having a personal assistant so he did not have to attend events he did not want to go to. Apparently, you are not allowed to swear now in Leeds. Stop the world. I'm getting fucked off. What a fantastic role model for youngsters. Fuck off. Are you from Manchester? Or just here for uni or something? Here for uni. Yeah, I thought you looked too exotic. Where are you from? <laughs> Birmingham. Right, just to get things straight, this is the dog my dad took a photo of yesterday. So some dope spotted decided to take a picture of my dad's van and post it all over Facebook, telling everyone to watch your dogs, basically saying he's going around pinching dogs. He took the photo because he couldn't get over how fat the dog was. He's a plasterer, not a dog pincher, and if he was to go pinch a dog, it wouldn't be that fat lump. Happy to be a one-star pub if this person's idea of a five-star pub is anything to go by. Looked okay from the outside. Too many local, unknown beers to choose from once inside. No Stella, Kronberg, etc. Or any popular global beer. We stayed for one pint and left to a proper pub that does well-known beers, bit of a hippie or trendy crowd to which wasn't impressive. Also, barman is far too enthusiastic and excited about selection of beers, so I came out to the house at 5 a.m. It's an amazing bar, we want the local stuff. This morning to check if the car was frozen, and I saw this bloke leaning on a wall with a walking stick. I thought he must be out of breath, just came to the door now at 6.40 and he's still there. I shouted, mate, are you alright? Then I got no reply. I walked down the road to check on him, and it's a smashed trampoline net hanging over the wall. Ha. <laughs> 
They do look like somebody. Ha ha ha. Woman feels discriminated by KFC over lack of meat-free options. I can completely sympathize. The other day, I went to the world of carpet to buy a new telescope, but was astounded and disgusted at the complete <laughs> lack of optical equipment. Yeah, why go to a chicken spot for vegan food? Like, go to a vegan restaurant. It almost, it's almost as if they would purposely set out to satisfy the needs of carpet buyers, but deliberately snubbed those who weren't. Utter madness. Great work by officers for having the sweet smell of succession. The males were stopped and had bags full to the brim with confectionery that was obviously not bought. Boundy, areola, mom bites, whatever those are called. What are the, the, the balls? For consumption by themselves. Approximately 367 pounds seized. Your head of year at school after you catch- But why lay it down like this? Is that one lad, Lucasades, and Chewitz at break? So you ghosted me? No, I did not. Your conversation skills were below par, and I carried the conversation all of the time. You are nonchalant, inexpressive, and your idea of taking an interest in me was a constant. How was your day? Having a conversation with you was not mentally stimulating. I did not ghost you. I just stopped entertaining mediocrity. Wow. That's deep. Oh man. Next person I say that, I'ma just you take a picture of that. That's. Copy paste next time somebody ever say I ghosted them. No, I just don't, you know, I'm carrying. My back hurt from carrying this conversation. Who's seen our Rocket Man jetpack deliveries to Glastrum delivers this week? Imagine just seeing this man at 1.32 a.m. flying around in a jetpack, delivering chicken wedges and a large pizza. You would be baffled, lad. He's clearly overqualified for that job. Go be a NASA engineer or something. He's clearly the better player. Can you just pass it around the bag for a second half? I want to eat some toast. The tallest mallard dog to ever have lived since the records began, known as Longboy. He lives on the campus of the University of York. He stands over one meter tall. A 100-year-old London. London pug. What the fuck did I just say? Pug? A pug's a fucking dog. Half of those, I'm not gonna lie, more than half of that was funny. I ain't gonna even hold you, man. TLL, leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post, I'm gone.